This is a picture I took a few years ago. It's a typical old style MK type socket that was connected to this, as shown in the picture. And when we remove the socket, it's got the green marks on the copper. This is typically seen in some cables uh, made in the 1960s and early 1970s. If you get the actual green goo, it's caused by the plasticator, plasticia, I think it's called. I'll put the correct term on screen. And that's actually used to provide the flexibility in the PVC polymer compound. Um, just going green itself could just be a, a sign of corrosion of the copper and an old installation. And the green is either from the sulfate or the carbonate. Obviously, if you see this, use gloves and eye protection uh, when this is found just as a precaution. And the cable itself ideally should be replaced. Like I said, it's often old and it can cause any sort of testing to fail as well. In this particular image, um, the cable looks to be um, the rubber sheath type. Um, again, from the late 60s, early 70s, uh, first type of cable that actually included an earth CPC that was between live and neutral. As you can see as well, it is multi-stranded and not solid core cable.